All right, this is a game that um, I've played uh, the last couple years every now and then with uh, my third, fourth, and fifth graders. I got this game uh, from the Great Activities newspaper that I get uh, twice a month, I believe. Um, and I, the, my students seem to love it a lot, um, and I love it a lot in the fact that uh, there are three different positions in this game um, where each uh, player has a different role for their team and the game is called the Knights of the Round Table um, and this is how it works um, you set up the gym here the these blue uh, rectangles here are mats that lay on the floor in the middle of the gym um, these green cylinders here are styrofoam cylinders that I have that represent the castles for both teams um, and I have them sitting on poly spots just so uh, if we game's over and we rotate, uh, the kids know where to set them. And same thing goes for over here. These are uh, styrofoam cylinders on on uh, poly spots, and um, and they're again called the castles. Now on the signal, well, let's take that back. E the different jobs are for the team is this: um, the students here on the mat are called the catapults. They are the catapults. So they're represented by the great, this is the great one team with the gray stars. This is another team with the white stars uh, players. These are the catapults here, and these are the catapults here. And then these stars here are the pages, or in this case, the ball retrievers. Their job is to run and retrieve the balls and stuff like that back to the catapults. Same thing goes for these white stars over here. They are the ball retrievers uh, for these white stars right here. Now these friends over here, these students, uh, with by the Red Stars are the Knights. They are on scooters. Um, their job is to protect the entire castles from getting knocked over by the catapults. Um, so on the signal, um, this star here, this uh, player by the white would try and catapult a ball to this. Um, castle trying to knock it over this player's trying to throw one here let's say and this player's trying to catapult the ball here and this one is trying to go here whereas on the opposite side of the mats um, they're trying to do the same thing so the gray's trying to throw a catapult the ball and knock that castle down this player is trying to knock this one down let's say trying to knock this one down by catapulting the ball and this player could go here so they're trying to catapult the ball uh, back forth, trying to knock the castles down. Now, obviously, if one team knocks all their castles down first, their team wins. Now, the thing to look for is that the catapults must have the ball in between their hands. They're not to throw. They're trying to use their stomach muscles and catapult the ball uh, to that direction. Now, the, star, uh, the uh, pages, okay, the pages... Once a ball has been catapulted, um, the page, uh, this player, this player would have to go and uh, retrieve the ball. So, so this player would go. So let's go back here. This player would have to run, go grab the ball that's been catapulted, and retrieve it back to their team. So. Let's clear this up here and get this all out of here for you. So after everything's been cat, uh, catapulted, okay, if this ball was catapulted by that star, went over here, this play, this page, this uh, page or ball retriever would go, and their job is to run, go grab the ball, and bring it back to the pages. Now the knights. Now the knight, now the knights here, they go up and down, trying to protect the uh, castles from getting knocked over. So, and again, they're on their scooters, up and down, trying to uh, prevent it from getting knocked over. They can usually use their hands or their feet. It doesn't matter. Or I guess that's up to you. Um, and and they were, and that's their entire job. Now. One thing I did find that's a tad confusing for the students is trying to decipher who's on what team when we get ready to rotate again. So, for instance, like these white stars are a team and these gray stars are a team, 
But obviously, the catapults on this, the knights on this team are with the gray team, and the knights on this side are with the white team because they're protecting. So, but uh, again, that's the knights of the round table. Um, I love it that they worked on their muscular strength with their, with their abdominal strength, with their stomach, a little aerobic fitness with the ball retrievers, then obviously manipulation and using their feet on the scooters. So, um, again, my students seem to love it. And um, I hope you guys enjoy it. And uh, more information will be on the blog.